So I wanted to issue the next challenge by video um, because it's hard to describe over over words or over over email, I guess. Okay, so the next challenge is going to be texture. Okay, it's a challenge devoted to learning how to paint and capture texture. Capturing texture is really difficult. It's really difficult to draw. It's really difficult to paint. And yet, like when you work with the scientific organisms that we work with in terms of like flowers or like biological organisms, insects, um, animals, they have all kinds of different textures. They're hairy, they're hard, they're shining, they're flat. There's all kinds of different textures that you need to be able to capture in digital painting. And you can't learn how to do that unless you practice. So the next project or the next challenge is called the, the the texture crystal challenge okay so if you go on pinterest and you search just like how to paint texture you get a bunch of things like this so these are like texture spheres so what this artist has done is they've taken different textures and they've composed and made spheres that represent those textures so like whatever this hair thing is whatever this metal thing is a shiny glass ball they've made different spheres a marble surface um, that represent those different textures okay and again, you can find lots of awesome examples of this. Also like amber spheres, um, wooden spheres, a beer sphere. And you see all the different textures that are captured in images like this. Like there's watery, shiny things. There's rusty. Like if you were to feel this, it would feel raspy and like, like sandpaper. Whereas if you were to feel the surface of this beetle, I think it's actually a beetle scutellum. If you were to feel this, the sphere of the beetle scutellum, it feels very smooth. Same thing right here. If you were to feel this, it would feel wet. So being able to paint an image that feels wet or that feels smooth or that feels rusty or that feels feathery, that's a really difficult thing to do and you can't do that unless you practice it. So our next assignment is to approach this challenge but we're not gonna do spheres and we're not gonna do cylinders like this amazing artist has done. We are going to do crystals. So here were my texture crystals from last year. They're all right, they're not that great, but they're all right. Um, and what I said to the students was you have to do three different crystals. And your three options are something that you love, something that you think is disgusting, and something that you love to eat, a food. So mine, the something that I love to eat is a rice, was a Rice Krispie texture crystal. So this was supposed to be a crystal textured with Rice Krispie. This was something that I loved, which was my butterfly, my, uh, my Damascus steel butterfly knife. So I tried to capture like the Damascus steel to, I guess, limited effect. Uh, and then something that you find disgusting which was for me was a texture crystal of uh, drain hair. And this project is always like really funny because you get really funny stuff. So this student did, um, I think, I think this is like a pomegranate. I think a pomegranate crystal, a something they like, a, a, a feather, a, a feather, bird feather, and then something they find disgusting, which is an engorged tick. And actually, like, look at the smoothness. It, like, there's a really great, really great engorged tick crystal. <laughs> we always get really funny things for these assignments. So obviously, this student's uh, dis disgusting crystal was a diarrhea crystal. <laughs> this uh, this excellent student did uh, mac and cheese crystal. Uh, I think dog crystal and then I think blood crystal this student did sushi crystal banana crystal and wood crystal so start thinking the possibilities are limitless and I would encourage you to use your own ideas think about your own crystals that you want to do something you like to eat something you think is disgusting and something you love and start thinking about your crystals See you this evening.